1,000 metre marker. Seve jumped a little bit awkwardly when the starter said go. Very quick into stride. Lots of silvers there. Roman Dancer. King Katini has a good position. Pick a winner of the white sleeves and cap. Molokai is also right there. And JJ's captain is about a length and a half off them. Then Mysterious Omen. Seve has about three or four lengths off the leader. And then comes Chapel Cleave. Pick a winner is going the quickest. Roman Dance is there. JJ's captain goes to the left-hand side. Lots of silver still right there. King Katini's towards the outside. JJ's captain pick a winner. Roman Dancer. Lots of silvers on the outside. Mysterious Omen still there. And it's JJ's captain and pick a winner over the last 100 metres. JJ's captain's going on though. And it's JJ's captain coming home to win it. JJ's captain has won it. Second will go to pick a winner. Mysterious Omen probably ran third. And then lots Lots of silver. So the winner, number eight, JJ's captain, Sean Veal. Dennis Dreyer, the captain L. He's got a nice form line behind Cue the Music and Jardin. Wins a length and a quarter. Number eight pays 340. Pick a winner, showed the pace, ended up the toad favourite, run second, Mysterious Oman third, lots of silver fourth, and then Roman Dancer. Further back in the run was Chapel Cleave. I just want to look at Roman Dancer at the 200. I saw its head go up. Uh, I just want to see if somebody's whip actually smacked it in the face or the gap closed. Uh, let's just look at the horse with the three or four off the left-hand side with the red cap. There, its head went up. And it happened just too quick, so it probably got checked. I don't know if the rider just flicked it across the face on the left-hand side. But the winner is number eight, JJ's captain, until the running of the third race, back to the studio.